It's good people. Uncle Hotep back at it again. How y'all doing? Happy Monday. Close down towards Christmas. And you know, uh, you know, big thing in America, you know, um, you know, people talk about, you know, the immigrant situation because we have a lot of homeless people in, in some of these cities, particularly our West Coast. You know, cost of living is so sky high. People just broke, they can't, they can't even afford to live out there. Actually, you know, they live in the streets. You know, some, uh, some of those left coast cities have tried a lot of different things imaginable, try to get rid of the homeless problem. <laughs> In the Seattle, I, I don't know what the hell they're doing in Seattle. This 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 white woman was making one hundred and hundred twenty eight thousand dollars a year to be the director of, you know, trying to get rid of homeless in the Seattle area. <laughs> hundred twenty eight grand. So they have meeting. You know, um, and it's crazy. It's like you got people that probably never been homeless, never know anybody that's homeless, and then you're trying to solve the how to get rid of the homeless. And we think you need people from that area. I don't know, it's just a suggestion. Anyway, for entertainment, under cultural entertainment, <laughs> at one of their homeless meetings, homelessness meetings, battling homelessness, they bring out a black transgender uh, named Beyonce St. James. Beyonce Black St. James, I believe. And she uh, got their buck dancing. <laughs> um, you know, I would think, you know, uh, matter of fact, you know, they had cultural thing at my daughter's school, right? And it was uh, for... Uh, it was like some Spanish, you know, different, you know, uh, South American uh, people, countries and, and traditions, you know, dances and shit like that, music. I hope black America sees what, you know, the, um, the white feminist uh, female sees as y'all culture. It's a joke to y'all. Entertain me, Beyonce, Black Jake James. <laughs> Get to dancing. Here y'all go. <laughs> something as serious as homelessness. You know, um, I wouldn't need, why would you even accept that? Like, if you're an entertainer, like, why would you like, hey, you want me to dance at your homelessness debate? I mean, <laughs> y'all fighting homelessness? Oh, let me go in there and cheer everybody up. This is sad, man. <laughs> like, I can't even believe, you know, we're made a mockery of, people are making mockery of people's situations. They, they don't care about solving the homelessness, do they? Do you think they're serious about solving the homelessness? She taking that hundred, that six figure job. She taking that six figure job, pocketing it, and, and, and then throwing money. This is taxpayer money. Hey, we need some entertainment. Why don't you we hire a black? Um, oh, I know this lady, black lady named Beyonce St. James. Is it real Beyonce? No, no, it's not the real Beyonce. <laughs> and another thing, you know, um, there's too many black men that think Beyonce is the role model. I've said this time and time again. I don't know how we came to this. I, I'll, I'll, I, I, <laughs> we'll be better off out, out of this era. But it's sickening that they have Beyonce as their role model. As their father, father figure. And, and you can see what happens when that when it happens. It is what it is. Anyway, this is Uncle Hotel. I'll talk to you all later, man. Peace. <laughs>